Um, and uh, I'm referring to a union turn. But in, in union turns got to have uh, its, uh, its folk singer. So ladies and gentlemen, I present to you the union turn criers. <laughs> I'm Carol Oppenheimer, a member of the band. This is the band. <laughs> but I actually have to say something about Christine because of what John reminded me of, which was Labor 2008. We had been on a trip to see our kids. They don't, none of them sadly live here in New Mexico. And in June, uh, Christine said, Carol and Morty, uh, how about running Labor 2008 for the, uh, this congressional district? And uh, we're like, whoa, we don't know how to do that. We, you know, we've run the mayor's campaign. But she said, I know you can do it, and labor needs you, and I need you to do it. So we said, OK, Christine. And it happened again in 2010. And, uh, um, the good news is that one of the goals was to get some younger people that um, have a lot of energy. And we now have, where's is Jennifer? Jennifer Garcia will, is now the head of our Central Labor Council. She's half our she's half age, and she um, will be, I know, very, very involved not only with our CLC but with uh, Labor 2012. And we will too, but not as the leader. So this is the Union Town Criers. Um, I'm going to take a minute. Don Manning, AFL-CIO, former head of the Salt of the Earth Steel Workers Union. Uh, Dan Rosen, who has uh, been a labor educator for many, many years, I think, and also the education director for the Textile Workers Union, and has been in Santa Fe for, um, what, how many, 10, 15 years doing labor-related activist work. I'm a member of Local 1000 of the Musicians Union, which I think uh, Pete Seeger was once a member of that Woo! union, Annie DeFranco and others. Um, Cheryl Bumpus is the head of NEA Santa Fe. Um, and Charlie and Marlene Lujan are um, very, very strong friends of labor, probably the best musicians up on this stage. <laughs> <laughs> Um, and they're friends of our brother, Mike Archuleta, from the Pipe Fitters Union. Um, <laughs> is a member of Ask Me. I've already introduced Jennifer, and we luckily, we're, I know we're in great company because we have the first lady, Carol Rose Koss, also oh, seeing <laughs> Does everybody have your words? <laughs> Wait, John, I, you don't have your words? You're going to share with Bianca. Sure, yeah. <laughs> All right, I just, every, I'm, no one's getting away. No one's getting away. And Carol Ann, we want you singing. I know you're. All right. So we're, and Charlie suggested we sing this a little slower so that. The, you all get the words. Now I want to just give you one more quick piece of information about this song. It should say it was written by Simon Oppenheimer and Simon uh, because um, our son Sam who um, worked for Tom Udall and was a very important piece of his life happened to be home for a week and this was a family project. Morty, Sam and I wrote the words to this song. So we want you all going home humming this song um, and you all know the tune. It's to the tune of Good Night Irene. Uh, but we made it up, Christine. Thank you, Christine. Wait, Christine, you don't have the words. Wait, uh, DJ, yes, we want you to sing along. And Dale and Karen and everybody. But now, Don, you didn't give me the ones with my with my notes on it, right? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay. All right, so everybody sing, and if you don't sing, uh, we're going to start it over again. So here we go. Sing, everybody, sing.
Yeah. 